Today I'm going to be showing you how you can um, put a file of any type inside a JPEG image and hide all your files from your friends or whoever you're trying to hide it from. <laughs> now, it's a neat little trick. Um, you can show all your mates. Um, what you have to do is just create a folder. I'm just going to call it something simple like X. And you have to drag your files in there. So I'm just going to put these. Oops. Drag them in there. And you've got to put the image in there as well. And I've already copied an image, so I just click paste it. Oops. Oh, it looks like I left to paste it again. I'll go in my pictures and go right to the bottom. It's a picture of Stone Cold Steve Austin. So we click copy and we paste it in a folder called X. So let's just paste. So here's a picture of Stone Cold Steve Austin. Um, I'm just going to call it Austin. And it's a JPEG image, and these are text documents. Now, what you need to do now, oh, don't need this anymore. You need to um, highlight the uh, secret messages or your files. I'm just going to drag out the JPEG image and now highlight all of these files. And if you've got 7Z, it's very easy. Right click, click 7Z, click Add to Archive and um, the archive name should be x.7z if it's in a folder called x if it's in a folder called secret image or something like that it'll be secret image.7z so anyway I'm happy with that so I just click OK and it adds them to an archive and you see these secret messages here they're in this little archive that's just been created now so there they are secret message secret message 2 and secret message 3 so now we only need this so we can delete all these messages like this delete yes so we've only got this and now we need to drag the picture back in stone cold steve austin yes let's just make sure it's normal we can't right click it click 7z and click extract here well we can but there's nothing there so an error message pops up we're going to make it so we're drawing these two together so when I extract it um, the secret messages that are in there will come out of the image so we're going to do that now what you've got to do is you've actually got to drag your folder that you just created called X or whatever you like to call it and you've got to go into start and then you've got to go on my computer um, Local disk C, documents and settings, and click on your user. My user's name is Lucas, so I'll click on that. And this is it. So now I drag my X folder into here. So I'll drag it right here. So there it is, the X folder with a JPEG image in, and I can press file. So now, how do I join them two together? Well, it's quite simple, really. Um, you go on to start, run, and type in cmd. Then a command line will come up. It'll say C documents and settings, and it'll have your user that you logged on to. What you've got to do is you've got to click cd backslash and put the name of your folder. My folder's name is x. So then it will enter your folder. C documents and settings Luca forward slash X. So it's in that folder with the picture and the um, compressed file files. Um, so now to join them together. This is what you need to write. Okay, pay close attention. You need to write copy in capitals space backslash B in capital um, and then put a space and put the name of the image. So I called mine Austin. And you've got to put the JPEG on the end, so dot JPEG, and then put a plus sign, space plus space, and then put the name of the compressed file. So mine was x.7z. And then 
you need to put the name of the new picture you want to call it. So I'm going to call mine Secret. Oops, Secret Austin. And then you've got to put JPEG at the end, otherwise it won't do it properly. Got JPEG. And then let's see what happens when we hit the enter button. If you see that Austin.jpg x.7 x.7z one file was copied. C documents and Luca X. So now if we close the command line and I'll go back into that file called X that we previously made, there is a new picture called Secret Austin. So now if we delete this compressed file and the other picture of Austin there is only secret Austin left in this folder called X. And in secret Austin it looks like an ordinary picture. Um, but what no one knows is that if you right click it, oops, if you right click it, click 7z zip, 7z zip, and click extract here. All the secret messages that was inside the compressed folder are now inside the image and these secret messages just came out of the JPEG image. Now if you're wondering oh what's in them secret messages, it's nothing really, I just made it up for this a little bit. It's just a bunch of funny writing so but if you want to put videos in there it's really cool. And you can hide videos from people or something like that. And um, it's to me, it's better than the zip folder. When you get the hang of it, um, I know zip, zip folder is easier. You just create it and then drag all your folders in. But when you get the hang of this and it's and it becomes seriously easy, then um, this is quite easy and it's a bit better as well. So thanks for watching. Um, hope you enjoy my video and if you like my tutorials please subscribe to my videos. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.